Hi guys and welcome to my YouTube channel Camp and Cook. Today I'll show you a quick and easy recipe for Italian risotto with bacon, sun-dried tomatoes and rosemary. The first step of course is cutting the bacon in slices. As you can see, that's what I'm doing. And that's how it looks like when it's ready. I cut this also in halves so that uh, the pieces can be smaller in the dish. That's what it looks like when ready. And I put that to the side so I can keep preparing the other ingredients that we will use for the quick dinner today. Risotto Italiano These are the sun-dried tomatoes that I use. Uh, in this case, something that we do every time is that we use the olive oil from the tomatoes for cooking oil and that's what I do in this case, as you can see. We are putting the olive oil in the pan that we will use for the dinner. And the next step, of course, is cutting the tomatoes for our risotto. Um, in this case, the um, amount that I'm using is half of the uh, package, which is about 70 grams in this case. And about the bacon, I forgot to mention, uh, this uh, piece that I'm using in this case was uh, 200 grams. So the tomatoes are also ready, cut in halves and in small slices. And we put them on the side with the bacon. That's how it looks like. And very important step that I always emphasize on is actually using fresh rosemary. I took it from the local store. As you can see and you probably know, it is much healthier and it makes the dish much more authentic really. And the rice that we use is arborio, perfect for risotto and I use about a cup and a half in this case. That's enough for about three people for dinner. So a cup and a half and I put it on the side of course. And that's how it looks like. And that's what it is like. We have been preparing for 11 minutes now. I also put the rosemary in the rice so that it can soak in and uh, release its flavors. Now I put the pan on the stove and I wait for it to heat up normally. And when it is uh, heated up, I put these ingredients inside so that they can fry a little bit before adding the rice. As you can see. We wait about 10 minutes or something for the bacon and the sun dried tomatoes to fry up and be ready. And it's time to add the rice. And now you just put it in the pan. And of course it's important to keep mixing up the um, ingredients on the stove so that they don't uh, stick to the pan. We wait about 3 to 5 minutes for the rice to also fry up a little bit. And when that's uh, happened, we add the boiling water. In this case, I'm using boiling water with the pre-soaked dried mushrooms in it, so that it can be um, also another ingredient that adds a lot of uh, great smell and also flavor to the dish. Then we start putting it uh, slowly in the pan, of course mixing up, and we put the uh, rosemary also inside so that it can release its flavors inside. And we keep stirring up the dish until it's ready for consumption. And before removing it from the stove, you can also remove the rosemary, of course. And leave it for five more minutes so that it can be perfectly ready for eating. And that's what we do. And the dish is ready for consumption. 
that's how it looks like. And of course it goes very well with a glass of white or red wine, according to your preferences. And boom.